This video is a bit unusual, but um, I just wanted to share this story with you because I just take so much from it. The last year was tough for all of us, but living through that pandemic changed me in a way I could have never ever dreamed of. And this is what I want to talk about today, the year that changed me forever. I know that there are people out there who had to face situations way worse than I did. So I'm not going to brag about how difficult the last 15 months were for me because they weren't. I didn't lose my job, I didn't lose a family member or friend. It was a bit like a very long but boring vacation for me. And the only real struggles that I had was when my girlfriend was in a hospital for an operation due to her chronic illness and when my dad was COVID positive. Other than that, I wasn't working so financially it was tougher, a bit more challenging. I turned 30 this year, and looking back the last 10 years, I was always one of those comfort zone guys. Scared of change, lack of motivation, but always dreaming big. Pushing me to think everything is good and fine, with my small apartment and my easy job. I wanted to be a movie star, an actor, famous, rich, and all the shit that you get presented with by scrolling through Instagram. But I was not willing to put in the work. I dreamed about the life of everything and I was expecting it to be gifted to me for nothing. I demanded a life that I wrongly thought I would deserve for just being who I am. All I ever did was go to work, watch television, go out with friends, I didn't sleep enough, my apartment always being dirty, I didn't work out, just ate junk food, fast food. To put it in other words, I was just not taking care of myself. And when the pandemic started and we all needed to stay at home doing nothing, I was kinda, alright, I'll take that. And I've always been like that. What? Don't need to go to work? Nice. I definitely don't hate my job, but it doesn't fulfill me either. And it's not like I'm a lazy employee, I do what I'm told, but getting to choose, I would always rather stay at home. But throughout the last year, something changed. After months of doing nothing, I started to feel incomplete. I felt like all of this is wrong. I realized that I'm just not happy with how the things truly are. It's like I, I lied to myself all this time and buried the truth underneath daydreaming about a miracle that's never going to come to save me. And for the first time ever in my life, I felt like I was really just wasting my time. So I changed and what a change it was. In January 2021, I came up with a plan for everything. I'm out of shape and my body hurts everywhere. Walking in yoga and it works. I notice my condition is going back up. I'm fat and unhappy about it. Eating more healthy. It doesn't work perfectly yet, but I lost eight kilos since December. Apartment being a mess, developed an efficient cleaning schedule and it does its job very nicely. Feeling unproductive and wasting my time, making a YouTube video every week. Wanting to be famous for no reason, don't knowing who I am, switching my mindset did the trick. I understood that whoever I am is determined by who I truly want to be. I don't crave for fame and rich anymore. I crave for a happy, fulfilling life that I create myself for myself. And her, obviously. And as it is for making YouTube videos every week, well, I've never missed an upload since the first Thursday of February. And there were even two weeks where I uploaded two videos. And since that, I went from 57 to 129 subscribers. YouTube is the change that I welcome the most. I made a few videos in 2019 and a few in 2020, but I never knew where to go. I know that I enjoy the process of doing them because I was always drawn to work with the camera, but I couldn't make it stick. I was way too focused on the numbers, expecting them to boost up to the top with every video I made and of course getting disappointed. This again is me expecting something to happen without willing to put in the work. But that changed. I want this to work, and not because I need to be rich and famous to be happy, because I don't, I understand that now, but because it gives me so much that I want this to be a full-time job. And for the first time ever in my life, I truly feel like knowing that this is what I want. I often thought I know what I would want to be, thought I know who I want to be. And now, I finally do. This guy. Minimalist! What the? Whoa. And all of these changes didn't just become changes, they became principles, they became top priority. 
And because I get so much from it, I will stick to them, no matter what it takes. The pandemic in Germany is softening. Rules and regulations get loosened and the hotel I work for is slowly moving back into regular business. And this is good, I'm happy for that. Me going back to work means I'm able to earn money like I used to, which makes living a bit more easier. But it also means I will have less time for all the things and priorities I do care so much about. What I'm trying to say is that in the upcoming future, there is a slight possibility that I might, perhaps maybe, I'm not going to be able to upload videos as frequently as I've been in the last five months. I will definitely try the hardest and do my best, but I just can't make it promise. And I hope you understand because to be honest with you, it just freaks me out a tiny little bit. Well, I hope you liked this video. It's a bit more personal focus this time, but I still also hope you can take something with you. Even, or should I say, especially if it's motivation to change something about your life that you are not happy with. I wish you all a nice day, week, month, year, decade, life. And I see you all around next week. Take care. Bye. Yep. That's it. Hmm? I think this was the take. Just talk fluently, spoke to the camera, lighting good, all that. Kind of messing up right now because I'm still talking and it's still recording. Maybe I should just... Maybe I should just cut the camera when I'm saying bye. Yeah, I think that's an idea. Yeah, I will. De I will definitely try my best. I will definitely do my best. I will. I will.